Good afternoon, everybody. Rick here, and uh, we're going to be doing another episode of American Truck Simulator. Uh, see, last time, see where we're sitting here because I can't remember. Um, we're sitting outside Sacramento. So, uh, let's see here. Did I have anything I needed to do to my truck? Nope, we're all good. So, let's go find ourselves a job. Now let's see what we got external contract wise. Let's see if there's anything interesting on a world of trucks. Let's see, I don't want these long, long runs. Let's see, I'm not looking for anything all the way over to Arizona. Let's see, these are way too long. Um, Nevada. Elko, we already passed that. We stopped in, if you remember correctly. Oxnard. Eh. Let's see, home accessories. Have I been to... I have not been to Santa Maria. Santa Maria. So we may go to Santa Maria. Uh, let's see. Mining. Well, that's too far away to pick up. Uh, actually, I guess I need to specify that I'm in Sacramento first. Well, I guess it defaults to Sacramento. My bad. All right. So we're going to go to Santa Monica. It's only 12000 um, Santa Maria, I mean Santa Monica. Uh, we'll take this one here because it's a little, it's worth a little more money. So let's go get it. I uh, can't remember if I'm doing it through the World of Trucks, which, which is where that job is from. Can't remember whether or not I've got to pick it up or not. So we'll just have to wait and see. I believe I do. Yep, it was. Oh, that's cool. I'm picking it up where I'm, where I left from. All right, so all right, it's on the other side. So let's see. Oh, I forgot to get my parking brake on, dummy. So we need to go around this way to pick it up. And once we get it picked up, we'll turn off the... Actually, I guess we can do it now. And let's see if we can find our trailer. It's supposed to be over on this side somewhere. There it is. And we're picking up our Wahlberg one, which I think is supposed to be Walmart. Well, I'll tell you what, this is going to be a little tricky. Alright. Sue's in there watching the office. Alright, here we go. Now we got it. Oop, except I'm after the wrong one. Try not to take out my mirror. Boy, I'm not doing very good right off the bat here, am I? Alright, so here we go. Now we should be able to get it. So anyway, we'll get hooked up. Alright, there we go. Kind of off-center, but what the heck. Let's take a look at it as it cranks up. Yeah. So, oh, it's just a little pop. Oh, well. That one's not too bad. Okay, what time is it here? Let me take a look. And we're doing fine. We're doing fine on fuel. Doing fine on time before we have to sleep. So, But I should turn the lights on because it's starting to get a little late. So let's get out of here. So anyway, I want to say hello and happy Tuesday to everybody. Hello, guard. We're just going to go by you here. 
Hope everybody's had a good day today. Uh, not a bad day at work today. Alright, so we want to go to the right. Okay. And one thing I did not check to see how many miles this is. So let's take a look at that here in just a second. It is 308 miles, so that's it's not a real long run, but it's not a real short run, so be about right, I think. It'll be about half an hour's worth of recording, which is what I'm looking for. Anyway, it was a fairly decent day at work today. It's very, very busy. So my uh, co-worker's back from England. He, uh, he had a good time while he was over there, so now I'm not by myself anymore, so that's pretty cool. Well, look at this guy in the blue truck. Stay there, buddy. Did you see that? He tried to sneak around the corner there and get in front of me so I could hit him. That wasn't very nice. So anyway, yes, he uh, he was over there for like 10 days or something like that. I can't remember exactly, but uh, he's, he said he had a good time. Uh, got to see family, which is a good thing. I guess uh, most of his family's over there. So, luckily he got in and out. He was, uh, he went over after the bombing thing at the uh, concert. So, uh, the concert there in Manchester, he went to Manchester. And uh, he left before this recent thing with the London Bridge. Now, I don't know anything, I, I haven't checked up onto that since I heard about it, so I don't know if that was a terrorist act, or just some disturbed individual, or what. So. <clears throat> Alright, so, I guess we're getting that on the freeway now. My limit's 55, but the stupid speed limit's showing 65 for the car, so that's not very fair. That's alright, I guess. So anyway, I started a new Let's Play here just a, a little while ago. Uh, on my tech, uh, on my Minecraft, this time is a, it's all tech mods, just tech mods, nothing else, because uh, I don't care for no magic stuff. So I'm not uh, I'm not going to include any magic mods. Um, I just I did decide I was going to try one on my own though, just kind of goofing around with it. It's called Ars Magica. Uh, see, you know what I think about it. I, I don't care for magic mods. I said that already, but we'll toy with it and see. I goofed around with Thomcraft and didn't care for it. So anyway. We're on our way to Santa Maria. So we'll go down here and drop this off. Pick up our money. And then, I don't know, I'm trying to decide if I want to upgrade the truck or if I want to trade it in. So I just don't, I don't know right yet. So, alright, so we're going to stay on I-5. We're not pulling off, so. We're going to stay I-5 south. Stockton, California, huh? Okay. Looks like we're going to have ourselves another nighttime delivery. Hey, let's go outside for an outside look here as a drive by. Since it's pretty straight. Oops, I'm still creeping over there. Alright. I think my joystick is a little bit off as far as uh, drifting to the left because it appears that it does that. Or my joystick, it's my flight yoke. It does that in all the games I play. This one, or uh, my farming simulator. Now, it doesn't do it in my uh, flight simulator because uh, I use a piece of software to put up a pretty good sized dead zone. So it doesn't, uh, doesn't affect it in that. Um, so anyway, today I sent the message off asking uh, Lockheed Martin, if I can get a copy of the 64-bit uh, version of Prepared 3D. So we'll see what happens there. I should be able to. 
Oh, that's a Goodwill truck. Okay. Yeah, we'll go ahead and flash him over. There, you can pull over. I guess that doesn't work in this. Oh, well. Let's try to be a nice person. So anyway. So anyway, we'll wait and see what happens and when my uh, copy of Prepared 3D see if they say yes or no or what have you. I'm supposed to be able to. I bought the thing like on the 19th of last month. So it's within the 60 days. So. Anyway. So we're going to stay on uh, I-5 it looks like. Keep on heading south. Now, if I remember looking from the map... Um, where am I? There I am. Right here, I gotta cut through here and go over here. Which is kind of strange, but okay. Just keeping my uh, iron a mileage here. We should be fine because I think it was only three. Yeah, it was only 300 miles. I got 942 miles worth of fuel on the truck, so we should be fine there. I could end up having to pull over here because it looks like I'm picking up on this guy. Let's see. Oops. Almost pull over and cut off a cop. That wasn't good. At least I think that was a cop. Alright, so up and around. So Santa Monica is a new place, or Santa Maria is a new place. Why do I keep calling it Santa Monica? Anyway. Santa Maria is a new place. We haven't been there yet, so we'll uh, head on over there, check it out, and I see a uh, best brake lights. How's that for slick? <laughs> ah, yeah, that was pretty slick, wasn't it? Thing there's no cops around though, because I'm quite sure he would have given me a ticket. Freaking everybody out. Ah. Anyway. Alright, you may have noticed that I did not do an episode of Outlast this last Saturday, uh, mainly because I really wasn't in the mood, to be quite honest with you. Um, you know, I don't find. It's no fun doing these things if nobody watches, but, uh, you know, I'll try and get one up there this week. So, maybe you and Jackie and, you, Jackie and Sabrina would be, uh, maybe you'll watch it. So, I can't even remember where we're at. I know we went through the kitchen, um, but I can't remember where from there. So... I do remember I got the pants scared off me a couple times. Alright, so we got a turn coming up here. So we're going to go up here and we're going to go towards Fresno. Just leave my turn signal on because we're going to turn to the right when we get up here anyway. Okay, we're good. Alright. Still 55. Now we don't have too far to go before we get back on an interstate, I think. <clears throat> I guess we'll find out in a few minutes. Let me see. Let me take a look at the map. Yeah. Oh, then we're going to go down Highway 101. Huh. I've heard a lot about Highway 101, just never been on it. Supposedly it's very scenic. Runs right up against the right up against the uh, Pacific Ocean, all the way up the coast. Uh, I don't know if it goes all the way up to Washington or what. But... Maybe, uh, maybe someday, you know, get my bucket list going, maybe I'll go up there and 
take a drive up 101 all the way up north. So what I'd like to do this summer sometime uh, before it gets you know too late and so on is I'd love to go to either Kings Island or Cedar Point. I haven't been to either one of those places in years and years and years and years. Um, so I'd like to go down there and get on some coasters. Yeah, and give me some roller coasters. I love roller coasters. Sue would go with me, but uh, I'd go riding them. Let Sue, uh, let Sue go to the shops. I'll go riding roller coasters. <laughs> All right, well, it looks like we've got our turn coming up here in a few minutes for uh, Highway 101. So, oh yeah. Come up on that a little fast. Didn't intend to do that. Oh well. Uh, how many miles we got left? 164 miles. Okay, so I can get out right away. That's cool. 164 miles. As soon as I get up here where I can get to speed and hit the cruise control, I'll find out uh, how many hours before I need to sleep. Kick her up to 55. 55. Okay, let's take a look. Ah, shoot, wrong one. 5, 6. Um, what do we got? 5 hours, almost 6 hours before I have to sleep. And I will be there in 4 hours. So we should be fine. Should have no problems. But after I deliver it, I'll need to find some place to sleep. See if I don't wreck the truck. All right. So yes, being as Tuesday, Tuesdays are busy. So it was very busy today. I think within an hour we got like seven or eight trucks in, and that's a lot of trucks to have in just uh, that short amount of time for just a couple people to handle. got, what was it, FedEx Ground, FedEx Freight, UPS, SIA, um, who else, uh, the treated lumber truck, the lumber truck, Larson and Dorfab, all within an hour. So things were definitely hopping for a while there. Now what I'd like to know is I'd like to know whether or not you guys want me to toss in some background music while I'm driving here, because you know, like I do when I when I play Minecraft, I have that music that I can play in the background. Uh, I can't play any copyrighted stuff, of course, uh, not without getting in trouble, which is a shame. But. bridge here. Stay on the road, Rick. Oh, speaking of FedEx, that's post-ed. That's cute. Instead of FedEx, post-ed. Alright, what we got? Uh, still going straight ahead here, it looks like. Straight down 101. I think I stay on 101 for the whole way down. I think after... Uh, after I complete this run, I think I'll probably call it a night. Tomorrow's home day. Yep. Stay straight down the road. Now, I thought Highway 101 run right up against the Pacific Ocean so that you could see the ocean as you was driving down the uh, down the highway, but I tell you, I haven't seen the ocean one time. So Oh, oh, wait a minute. What do we got here? Whoa, get in your own lane. What do we got over here on the right? 
No, those are just buildings. So, yeah, I don't know. I have to... Supposedly it's very, very scenic. So, I don't know. Maybe it's really scenic up through Oregon and Washington or something. Northern California. So I think Southern California is more like a desert type thing. So, what we got over here on the right? Eh. No water. This just must be a cavern or cavern, chasm that this thing's covering or crossing. So I don't know. You'll have to let me know. What should I do? Should I hold off and uh, buy me another truck? Or should I upgrade my existing truck? Alright, if you're watching, let me know which one I should do. Um, I'm not sure how much money I have once we're done here, but I will have enough money to upgrade stuff to it. Uh, I have to trade it in. I'm not sure. I've checked to see what the costs are on the trucks themselves to see which one I can get. So, if we decide to trade it in. But I need everybody's input on that one. You have to let me know. Which I should do. Upgrade or trade in. So. Looks like it's going to be a nighttime delivery. Imagine that. Such is the life of a truck driver. Alright, let's see how many miles I got. Uh, 62 miles. Oh, sorry. Well, I tell you what, <clears throat> this Realistics Physics mod, when you hit the uh, steering wheel like that, quote, unquote, steering wheel, man, it reacts quick. Watch. Yeah, see? So. And you can flip the truck, believe me, I've done it before. Maybe maybe just before I uh, trade the truck in, we'll flip it. What do you think? <laughs> Let's wreck it and trade it in. How's that sound? Let's see if I can break the game doing it that way. <clears throat> I've never done that before. I don't know if it affects the trade-in price or not. That would be kind of interesting to find out. Alright, we got an exit only coming up here, and I don't want an exit only, so I need to get over. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, the exit only is on the right there. Okay, so we stay where we're at. That's not quite correct, the way they do that, but that one, I've seen that before with the exit only, but uh, I haven't checked yet. I haven't come up to a stoplight. Uh, I think there was an update here when I loaded this. I want to see whether or not they removed the stop signs at the stoplights. So, okay, we don't want to go that way. It's Santa Cruz. We want to go to Santa Maria. Santa Maria. So, I don't know. I heard something about them possibly as a download add-on to uh, go across the border into Mexico with this. So, I don't know. That might be kind of interesting. As long as you don't get stuck in a whole long line of cars trying to get across the border. We got. We have got 18 miles, so we should be coming up to a turnoff here pretty soon. Yeah, you know, I wonder why <clears throat> there are no street lights, because I know for a fact that these freeways they have uh, street lights. I don't know why SCS hasn't put any street lights on there. Don't know. Alright, so here's our exit coming up. So we'll go ahead and get rid of the cruise control.
here and we're gonna hang a right. Santa Maria discovered. Okay, so we can turn right on red. Let's go ahead and head around here. <clears throat> Up here to the T and turn to the left. I don't see anything that says I have to stop, so. Well, this looks kind of fancy, doesn't it? What we got there? Donuts! Okay. I just didn't know it lit up like that at night. That's pretty cool. So when we come out, what we'll do is we'll immediately head over there and get some gas. Um, Alright, let's go ahead and... Oop, that is not what I wanted to do. Although that looks kind of cool. Uh, what the heck? That's weird. Okay. Now how close did I get to him? I think I got closer than I meant to. Whoa! Yeah, I guess I did. Sorry, Bob. All right. So this is going around the corner here. And it goes to the right. Uh, let's see here. Okay. Swing out. All right, let's see. I think we want the experience, so this one shouldn't be too bad. Two. Yeah, see, this isn't bad. I should be able to handle this one without too much problem. my flashers because I'm backing up. Looks good. We'll get it first try, I think. It's almost perfect. Parking brake. And this. And there we go. Job completed. Excellent. All right. 309 miles. It took 27, 27 minutes. I wonder if that was real time. 27 minutes. Anyway. Uh, 43 gallons worth of fuel to go about 300 miles. That's that's not too bad. I've done seven World of uh, Trucks contracts, so that's not too bad. So let's see, did we up? We hey, we leveled up, very good. So we ranked up to a um, level eight, and we got fun a 40 bonus experience. A long distance delivery bonus. I don't think that was long distance, but anyway. We got a total of 12,539 bucks out of that and 662 experience points. So, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and kick up the high value. Yeah. 
All right, so this is uh, this is what we got. Now I can go ahead. We got a KW, so I can upgrade to these different things if I want. Um, these are dual exhausts and stuff like that. Um, chassis change, hub covers, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, or Let's take a look at the truck dealers. What do we got here? Uh, we have a Kenworth dealer, KW dealer here. Yep, let's go check out the dealer. All right, so this is what we're rocking right now. Okay, so we can trade in uh, for an add-on, which is that. I don't like that one at all. Don't care much for that one. Don't care for that one. Uh, no, I don't care for that one. Now, this one's pretty cool. I do like this one here. Uh, current price on this one is uh, trade ed value is 90 grand on the one I have. So I'd have to pay 43,000. So I've got enough to buy this one if we decide we want it. Uh, okay, let's see. Don't like that. The yellow one, yeah. Man, I'm going to stick with the. Now, I like this one here. This one's pretty cool. I like that big sleeper. Um, we can always change it to red or something like that. Well, wait a minute. Hold on, man. Let's back up and take a look at this one here. Yeah, the sleeper is a little bit different on that one. But I do like this one here. Uh, I have enough to pay for this one, too, as you can see. 68, 61. Uh, so I could do it. Uh, let's see here. That one's pretty cool. Uh, but I can't get it yet because I'm not level 13. Uh, this one here, everything below this I can get, I believe. Wait a minute. No, I can't get that one. I can get that one. And then, of course, I didn't like those. So, uh, you tell me what we should do, ladies and gentlemen. Should we go ahead and trade in and get this one or this one? Or keep the one we have and upgrade? So, because I can't... I don't think I can get any of the others. See, it's level 13 for that one. See where it says... Uh, that one there looks really strange. Up here where it says available from level 18, that's what I'm talking about. So I can't get those. See, I'm not uh, not that level. I'm only level 8 right now. Uh, so let's just keep looking here. Thank you. Level 10. That's cool. I like that one. I'm getting close to this one, though. All right, anyway... <clears throat> Excuse me. So we will uh, we'll figure out what we do next time. Um, you have to let me know whether or not we're going to upgrade or whether or not we're going to trade it in. So just uh, leave a comment below and let me know. And uh, give this a thumbs up if you liked it. And uh, be sure and pass the word along concerning my channel. And uh, I will talk to everybody later. Mahalo for watching. And aloha.